So, welcome everybody. I wanted to record a very quick vlog, and uh, I said during the week that I wanted to, uh, and I decided that why not? Might as well film it outside. The weather's quite nice. Not too sunny, not too hot, not too, well, raining. And nobody's seen the garden before, so I thought I'd do it out here because, you know, why the hell not? It's my video. <laughs> so, uh, what I want to talk about is live streaming. I am still live streaming for the people who haven't seen me on Twitch for a while. That is because I've now switched across to YouTube live streaming. Now, there's a few reasons to be using YouTube rather than Twitch, and uh, I mean, a lot of it's on the back end rather than on the front end. Some of the things that YouTube gaming's a lot better than Twitch at is, for example, I'm able to stream at much higher quality on YouTube than I am on Twitch, a whole 2 megabits per second uh, extra bit rate. Uh, a lot of the back end stuff's just a lot easier as well, like the full integration with the YouTube channel, so rather than having to export and import uh, videos and such across from Twitch to YouTube, it's just a lot easier to make highlights directly on YouTube and whatnot. Um, so that's some of the reasons. I mean, some of the things aren't as good, like chat. Chat is technically as functional as Twitch chat. You don't get the, the sub emote because there's no such thing as uh, paying subscribers yet. But to be honest, I always felt sub emotes were a little bit gimmicky. Um, but I know a lot of people like them and a lot of people care about them, so we'll not, we'll not wax lyrical too much about that. Um, some of the downsides with chat is it's just really hard to integrate it. Um, so sort of to chroma key it. And it has started to fucking rain. It would, wouldn't it? As soon as I start making a vlog, it decides to rain. We'll wrap this one up quick. So what I want to say is, short and sweet, definitely still live streaming, but it's on YouTube instead of Twitch. The problem that YouTube Gaming has is it doesn't email people when I go live. So to try and mitigate that, what I'm doing is I've set up a public Google Calendar. There's a link down in the description below. You can click on that and go look at the calendar, and that'll give you a very good uh, rough guide on when I'm going to be streaming, what days, what times, and what games I'm thinking about streaming. So if you follow that, you'll know roughly when and where to turn up to catch something. Uh, other than that, you could just keep checking your sub feed inbox, or you could check Twitter, because I'll tweet out every time that I go live. Also, uh, if it continues to be a problem, then I might just set up a web form on a website, and you guys can sort of sign up with your email address, and I'll manually email everybody whenever I go live. Uh, that's another possibility. God, it's really starting to come down. So let's wrap this up. Um, one question I wanted to ask you guys, and to leave it in a comment below, is... Um, with the streams, I'm thinking about going two different routes. Either, well, three different routes. Either make the full video on demand available after the stream is the first choice. Second choice is just make highlights out of it and post the highlights on YouTube. Third choice is pull out highlights of the videos for the guys who, who already watch the stream and don't want to watch the full stream again or just don't want to watch the full stream and make the VODs available so that people who miss the stream can then watch it in real time uh, after the fact. So let me get, let me know what you guys think is the best idea. At the moment I'm leaning towards making highlights and making the full VOD available but uh, like I said I want your input on that and whether you guys think that that is a good idea. So very quick takeaway points are Still live streaming, but it's on YouTube now instead of Twitch. Uh, check out the Google Calendar to know roughly when and uh, on what day and what time that I will be live streaming and what games it'll be. At the moment, I'm generally live streaming World of Tanks during the day, uh, pretty much every day. And then it's uh, a combination of Minecraft, Heroes of the Storm, and more World of Tanks on the evenings. So definitely check out that calendar. Keep an eye on your sub box and maybe sign up for Twitter if you're not already and uh, live streaming is still happening. So thanks very much for watching guys, don't forget to let me know what you guys think in the comments below and I'll catch you next time.